Hello everybody, welcome back to another episode of Cupid Gaming, where we are playing uh, Sweden by Connor, I guess. Yes. Last episode we did, uh, we basically did the entirety of Phallic Mountain, I think. Yeah. No. You did some farming of No, no, wait, we did a, a bit, and then we, yeah, it, we did Phallic, Phallic Mountain in two episodes. You did one exploring thing, and I did the other thing with the, all of the side quests and the story stuff. Yes. Today we are going to go and do more side quests, of course, and we're going to start off by reconstructing Calony 6. So, let me go and take a look at my document and I'll tell you where to find a couple of these things. So, for housing level 3 you need one uh, X iron heart, heart. You can get them from X in Magna Forest. Those are like the horse type enemies in Magna Forest. Mm -hmm. Or you can trade them with Nello if you have two stars of affinity with Alchemist. And Nello is the drunken, um, the always drunken uh, not one in Alchemist. Okay. Sturdy armor, you can get them from, from Andos in RC. Those are the robot things in, Andos, uh, in RC. You can also trade them with Galdo in Alchemoth, who is one of the guards standing at the bottom of the Great Hall uh, staircase during the night. Yeah. Nello is also during the night. Then the oil branches are collectible from RFC, and you can trade them with, with Scarlet, who is uh, the, the one guy who was the, uh, was the father of those two children that always got lost. Yeah. Oh no. Maybe? Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> Look it up, if I'm wrong. <laughs> Actually, you'll probably just look it up anyway, because this is not a guide. More housing. We. I also decided to collect all the stuff off camera because you don't want to see me collecting this stuff. Ta -da. Ta -da -da. I like that. I find I find that freaking thing to be quite funny actually. It's just a it's like a peacefulness and then turn it. Ta -da -da -da. It doesn't fit actually. All right, Whoa. commerce. Uh, we need shiny chromar hides, which drops some palti and some mati chromars in RSC. You can trade them with Ariel in Alchemoth. Two slick chromar stones, they can drop from flutes, Melenza, Old Otal, Tussock, or Tussock. Yeah. Chromars in RSC, and you can trade them with Yora in Alchemoth. Um, else, you also need two blue ladybirds, which are collectible from High Entia Tomb, and you can trade them with Cyan if you have four stars of affinity with Alchemoth. Or with uh, High. Upper Biomas, that's the name. Yeah. There we go. More shops. More kind of useless shops. They sell really bad stuff. Hmm. Alright, for Nature 3, we need uh, Jagged uh, jagged Tails, which are drops from Earth Hilms. And we can trade them with Coralf, which is one of the two adventurer bros. You can get, uh, you need to get two Despair Clovers, which are collectible from ARC and can trade them with Atael in Alchemoth also. And Ice Cabbages. And the two Ice Cabbages. MY CABBAGES! They... They are collectible in Valak Mountain, with a 6% chance to be found only during the night. It sucks. I was lucky to get one when we were going through the area normally, and I farmed a little bit and I got another one. I farmed a little bit more to try and get the one for the Galactopedia, but I couldn't because... Well, I just decided to stop farming for the time being. So we'll come back to the collect video of Phallic Mountain later. Alright, right, final one. <clears throat> Special 3. You need two Squall Elements, which are drops from Bono Nebula on, in RC. You can trade it with Nello in Alchemoth. Uh, you need two Snow uh, Elements, which drops from which drops from the Reef Nebulas in Phallic Mountain. Uh, three Lemonade Sky, which is a collectible from Magna Forest. You can trade it with Kilaki in Frontier Village. TV. You also need a lot of money, actually. But as long as you've done all of the quests that we have been doing up to this point, you shouldn't have an issue with money. Ooh, fancy. Yes, a bit of a fountain park place. Park place. Welcome to Park Place. <laughs> there you go. That gives uh, that brings Colony Six to a new level. There you go, more street lights and we get a reward. We get topple plus four gem. Which nice. will extend the time that the topple will be going for, I think. Enemies are attacking one of the colonies <laughs> ether planters. <laughs> Maybe they are attracted to the ether there. How about you deal with these things? So we have another one of those. We have like the mechon attack and then we have the uh, this one now. So, open up your map, and I think you want to go back over to the place where the freight elevator is. 
No, wait, that's this place. The freight elevator. It was written down oh. on your map. Oh. Get the items. I'm actually not sure if they're over here. They could be in multiple places. You need chalk for the Mechon. No. If these are if these are the Mechon, you need chalk. Otherwise, you can switch to somebody else. If they are over here, of course. They are not. In... Go back upwards. Because. It could be that they are because um, I don't think I've have this I have these ones written down because no, they are just automatic quests and yeah I didn't need to read them uh, uh, write them down because what's the point? Uh, they should be all the way in the bottom right here. Let's see. Units in the area of the Eater Plants are the Pod Depot. They should be over here somewhere. Maybe. Yep. You see it over there? Like that little fork sticking on the ground? There are some icon over there. Oh. Kill them. Oh, sorry, they're Ignas. I'm sorry, they're not the uh, These are the lizard ones. They're really easy, so you should not worry. Don't you like the electric gutbuster? Everyone, let's go! You shouldn't worry too much about drawing the aggro, these enemies are not high enough level to train. That's the thing about agility in this game, like once from the point that you are um from the point that you are really high level compared to the enemy, your agility is already gonna be really high, which makes that a miss, and then upping your agility even more with agility gems will make it so that the enemy is basically can't I see. Well, they can hit you, but even if they hit you, it's not gonna be. It's not gonna do anything. Well, the thing is, the body gauge goes down anyway when you're not inside of a battle. So. Here we go. Where you where you can just use a chain attack, unless if you're in a boss battle, that you want to. I don't know, man. It's just Backslash. Backslash. Now we're working as one. We're counting and on he's you. dead. Uh -huh. oh. That's a stabbing one. All the way to the right is two hits. Pick the one all the way to the right. Catch up. That's gonna kill him. Three times. Catch up. That's dead. Never gonna give up. And now I just we just got another achievement. Colony six celeb. Which means that we have three stars of affinity with colony six. Which is super handy, actually. Because now we can... Oh, now we can trade for another one of those really rare items. Okay, now go over to the pot depot that's back there. Wait. Up the mountain. Oh, okay. There should be around there somewhere. Um, let me go and take a look at the other collection. <clears throat> well, I might want to get these items. You should look for another fork. To your left, maybe. Ah! Ah! Uh, attack on M64 armor plus. Uh, enchant, yep. Okay. Let's sort this out nice and quick. I could have bought the mech on the anti mech on the like weapons. But we're gonna do a lot of stuff that we're not gonna have to fight mech on, so it would be pointless to equip them right now because the damage is also quite a lot lower with those weapons. You can hit mech on normally, but all basically all of the other things are bad about them. Here's a chain. Oh, Press A in the middle. Thank you. No. <laughs> Alright, now just use a. You're in front of him. You're not gonna be able to do burn his damage. Mm. Just Does do a red art, yeah. This, this one? It doesn't matter, you can choose. Oh. It's not that. It's not that important of a battle, so. Use worldly slash, maybe. 
Got a headshot. If you're lucky, you might be able to continue. Okay. Monado Bust, please. I ordered a Monado Bust. It's to the right. The offensive ones are to the right. That's gonna hurt. Damn. That's all damage. Nice. There you go. Don't forget to get chest. Okay. How about you go over to the reconstruction HQ for me? Okay. Those crystals are not gonna be broken. Or maybe they are. Oh wait, yeah, they are. Of course. So I think. Wait, let's see. A pretty one. Hmm. Um, because I think when you upgrade the special level of Colony Six, all of the Ether gems in the mine and over here are gonna be like upgraded to the next level, huh. to the next tier of uh, materials, which is really good. Totally forgot about that. Okay. Um, now go over to Macrish. Her. And trade. Don't talk. Trade. Hi there. So now that we have three stars of affinity with Colony 6, we can trade for another one of those other items. Uh -huh. Go to the atoms. The coin of fortune. You have nothing you can trade. Well, there goes, uh, there, there goes that idea. <laughs> That'll be for later then. No problem. Okay, it's time to do side quests again. So, uh, you should go over to Colony 9. Oh, it is. You need to go to Colony 9 and you need to go to the military district. In the middle of the military district. You also have to turn into that. We need to invite some people into Colony 6 now that it's become a lot better. Look at this stuff. Like writing this stuff down, like where they are, which time and which people you have to... Have to, man, that, was, that was the most annoying thing to do. Okay, turn to night and go to the middle of the district, and you should find a nopon called Mephi Mephi. Mephi Mephi? Mephi Mephi. Mephi Mephi. Yes, you. Mephi Mephi has decided to move. Colony 6 is near home village and has lots of grass as well. But Mephi Mephi is still a bit confused. Mephi Mephi's life here is not so bad. Mephi Mephi knows other, another scientist in Colony 9, but not very well. It would not be good if two scientists move away. Should I leave my work to other scientists? Invite the Colony 6. Thank you so much. Mephi Mephi will do a good job. Mephi Mephi will go and see friends and get ready to go. Mephi Mephi hopes she can see you in Colony 6 sometime. There you go. Mephi Mephi has moved. What the fuck? Um, now we have to go over to Apex Lake in, uh, in front of the village. Apex Lake, Apex Lake. Is that all the way yep. on the top? Apex, it means the top, so that's Apex Lake. Should be a knob on not a transport guide behind you. Or maybe not. A, no, wait. Okay. She's over there. Uh, in front of you. Oh? She's on the platform. Platform? That one. Oh. Not not a transport guide, the other one. Very jammy. Very jammy, not want to stay in this village? Will not go out while sun is up. Others treat me different. Want to live in a village about this size with lots of greenery. But with few knob on in it. Invite to Colony 6. You mean such a dream village actually real? Barry Jemmy want to go there. Hom Hom will definitely accept Barry Jemmy for what I am. Will not treat me different because of Miss Sweetness thing. <laughs> Thank you, friends. And there we go. Okay, another person that we need. You need to go north of the reservoir. North of the reservoir? Yes, in this village. We are inviting all the Nopon. No. Go and open up your map for me. Uh, All the way down. I want to see something. Go to the... All the way down. Go to the left. Go to the left. That is the reservoir. Uh, where is it? North of the... Okay. Uh, go one floor upwards. Go to the Nopon Tower. 
Go that way. I like this way. Mm -hmm. right. Go towards the reservoir. And also turn it to six o'clock. There should be a Nopon with a name. There she is, blue dot on your map. She's walking away now. Nora, Nora wants study, will want to study medicine to create cure for her sick friend. But studies are not advanced enough here in village. Nora, Nora, I need to go and study in Col uh, Colony 6 with where good teachers are. Please take me there. Invite to Colony 6. Thank you so much. Nora, Nora will surely create cure for her friend's sickness. There you go. Okay. Now go to Colony 6 to actually do a freaking quest. Shook needs to be in the party, but he's already at the front, so that's good. Okay, um, go past, like, go to the main street. That's not the main street. This one? That's the main street. Listen to this, all these people. Yeah. The town is becoming lively. Whoa. And go to the right now. Hey, up the balcony. Sweet. Oh, did we get this one? No, it's a new one, I think. Silicon Dam Man. Bank Infinity. And talk to her. Yay! Nora Nora is studying to find cure to her friend's illness. But Nora Nora have big problem. Could you go into more detail? Yeah, maybe there's something we can do. Thanks, Shola. Let's find out more. And break my back in the meanwhile. Matthew and Matthew have, uh, have wacky uh, theory that Nora Nora's friend ill with cursed. Nora Nora not believe her, but Matthew and Matthew is more experienced. So Nora Nora, uh, so Nora Nora, yeah. Nora Nora want friends uh, to help Matthew and Matthew. If Matthew and Matthew correct, Nora Nora's friend in big trouble. While friends away, Nora Nora will continue to make medicine. Finding it. Whoa! Sorry. It's strange for a scientific minded person to be considering curses. I rather agree with Shulk. But Matthew Matthew sounds so sure. She always so sure. Friends must help her. There you go. Please find Matthew Matthew and ask her what to do next. Thank you, friends. No problem, leave it to me. So, if you're wondering like when to skip those little moments where they like, say their same stuff always to get affinity, it will always be after you have either accepted or declined the quest. Not before. Okay, just fair enough. Okay, it's time to speak to Matthew Matthew. Uh, it needs to be night. Oh. Now the place where she was just at. Oh. As you can see, there's an exclamation point. Now Rara told her friend is sick. Told me her friend is sick. Her friend very sick. Uh, she says friend not like Mr. Sun anymore. Mephi Mephi knows the reason why. Narara's friend is cursed. Mephi Mephi knows how to lift curse from Narara's friend. A fragment found where Mr. Sun rarely visits is the key. It caught the statue fragment and the place is set on marsh. Huh. It found in high up place where Sororal statue stands. Using the strange power of the fragment, her curse can be lifted. Collect the statue fragment. Go to Saddam Marsh. From the statue summit in Saddam Marsh, climbing down from the far west of the statue to find it. The statue summit, that's where I need to go. Statue um, where the fuck is it? Find it yourself. It's actually pretty easy to find. If only you used that magical D pad that you have. You scroll down the list and see when you find oh. the statue seven. <laughs> I should have probably told you it was in that mark, so no. Yeah. Oh, 
Okay, from the statue, summit inside the marsh, climbing down far, uh, down the far west side of the statue. Uh, to the left, yeah. That way. <laughs> Fucking cabbage. It was a humming cabbage this time. That's not gonna kill you. You can see it on your map now. Exclamation point. That's where you need to go. He won't attack you, by the way. The level 90 <laughs> monster or something. Yeah, you can go over the shoulder. You can get the skiff, which is a deposit. Okay. Now you need to go down the waist. So you can drop down. Very carefully. You can drop down and you can see like a little ledge, that's uh, the place you have to go to. There you go, and then if you follow this, you will get yourself that thing. Now continue going, because there are a couple of items over there that I want you to get. Because these items, you're like not this way, you know, that way. <laughs> this place is very special, because the items that spawn over here can only be respawned after you shut off your console and reset your console. Oh. But this is also the place where you will have the highest amount of chance to find some of the rarer items in this place. Okay, go back to uh, Mephi Mephi. You don't even want to know how long it took me to find these two NPCs, by the way. <laughs> I have no idea why I had so much issue finding it. But at least now I know it's out of my head where they are. Because well, actually the reason why is because those exclamation points don't appear that fast. Oh. That is, that's it, friends, have it! Now power of Master Sangya, Master Sangya, weak and Norara's friends curse be lifted. Take it to Norara. Uh, switch around today and give it to the other knock over here. Good timing, friends. Norara all finished with medicine. All Norara needs to do is mix ingredients with medicine. Friends, wait here. Wow, we medicine twice as strong now. Mephi Mephi is a brilliant scientist. Friends can drink this anytime and it cure friends of illness. Thank you. Got everything worked out? Arara, very grateful, friends. Here we go. Dang, diddly done. Alright, now we have to switch Ricky in the party. Okay, Get up on Ricky! Get on, Ricky! You can play as Ricky now. If you want to. Or do you want to play as Shulk? Uh, I want Ricky. Even though Shulk does have the quick sometimes. But that doesn't really matter much. Unless if I have to farm, then I'll just switch back to him. Friends, come here! Narara grateful for medicine, but Lazy Bones Berry Jemmy no drink it. Narara made medicine taste nice, but she still refused to drink it. Berry Jemmy is not getting better. Wah! This is crisis, yes? Yeah, it sounds bad. Narara worried for Berry Jemmy's life. Can friends persuade her to drink medicine? Ricky know what to do? Berry Jemmy from the same village as Ricky. Then you will help Berry Jemmy. Please, friends, we have to. Convince Berry Jemmy. Narara think one person, not enough to persuade her. It's best to have lots of people try and talk to Berry Jemmy. Huh. Narara already tried lots of ways to make Berry Jemmy taste. Take it. Easy peasy, here upon take care of it. Yeah, give it your best shot, Ricky. Yes, yes. Ricky and Sadkit Shulk together. Alright. Uh, we need to find Berry Jemmy. Oh, uh, where the hell is She's in, a, in an alleyway. If you go back over this way. And then you... Um, I think... It's this alleyway. You have to turn it to night, yeah, and she I... should be here. Hopefully. 
What's the time? What do you mean? No, it's it's like 10 for 6. Berry Jemmy, listen to here upon. Berry Jemmy must drink medicine or else big trouble. People worry about Berry Jemmy. And Rara, Ricky, and family too. Uh, that's why Berry Jemmy drink it down. Ricky not Berry Jemmy that upon. <laughs> Berry Jemmy same as Ricky sit upon back at village. Naughty and spoil, uh, spoiled. Okay, now switch. You have to switch different people in. <clears throat> now, I want you to switch everybody and talk to her as, and then wait with Dunban for the last because Dunban is the one we can convince her. Okay. But I just find it really funny how this Nopon reacts in all of this. Aren't you, aren't you going to drink the medicine Aurora made for you? Very Jemmy not want to drink something that looked bad for me. That's it. <laughs> okay, switch the Ryan in the front. This is gonna be glorious. <laughs> With Ryan, it's probably gonna be glorious. Oh yeah. If you don't drink that now, you're gonna get sicker, kid. Very Jemmy not sick. If anything, Barry Jimmy is sick of being bullied like before. That doesn't sound too good. <laughs> hmm. Alright, Maria! And then Sha. Good old Sha. You must drink it or you will only cause yourself more pain. Is pain something you like? B -b -b -m 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 Mary Barry Jimmy not sick. And Barry, Barry Jimmy is sick. But that you should stop being mean. So you are sick, that you should drink it. But, 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 but Barry Jemmy, Barry scared. <laughs> yeah. Alright, Charla. How are we gonna do with this sticky wicket? <laughs> you should know Narara poured her heart into making that for you. She spent all night studying what cures and medicines might work. That medicine contains all the love and kindness Narara has asked for you. She cares about you so much, she made a cure for your illness. So be a good girl and drink it up now. I'm grateful to Narara, but Barry and Jemmy not care, we'll make it, not going to drink it. What a bitch. <laughs> Alright, time for Dunban. Alright, Dunban, manly man of the manest man. Scared, huh? Little one, drink your medicine. If you don't, how can you enjoy the outside with your friends? Very Jemmy like you! Hum hum man cool! The medicine might not look nice, but I assure you it tastes good. And many people went to a lot of trouble to make uh, to work, hard work to make that medicine. Do you understand what I'm saying? Yes, hum hum sir. Very Jemmy be very good knob on and drink it all up. Very Jemmy drink it uh drink up all medicine and get all better. There you go. Oh, let's go back to uh, the other one. The other one. <laughs> Got damn flowers in my way. I will cut them down. <laughs> yeah. Mulatto buster. <laughs> no, 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 no. He needs to do something else, like blossom dance or something. <laughs> blossom dance. <gasps> cut down all the flowers. Yay. Yay! She took her medicine. It is miracle. Barry Jemmy will definitely get better if she take it every day. Now she built up her immunity against illness and all uh, and be all well. Don't worry about it, it was nothing. That's right, you'd have done the same for us. <laughs> no. <laughs> if not long before, uh, if not long before Barry Jimmy can play outside with Narara. Narara can't wait. And dang diddly done. Okay. Um, now we have to go back over to Barry Jimmy. So we have to turn back tonight and talk to Barry Jimmy again. <laughs> this entire quest line is... I think we're going to do basically this entire quest line. <laughs> um, <laughs> it's a me, you done, Ben. All right, Mary Jenny. Medicine tastes yum yum. Me want more and more. Friends, bring Barry Jemmy more medicine to drink. Hmm. You're in trouble. Hey, try and talk about it. I'll, it'll make you feel better. <laughs> Barry Jemmy, very busy with drinking Norora's medicine. Go get Barry Jemmy some more. Ah, I see. I think what we have here is the most spoiled Nopon of all time. 
Medicine work on berry jammy. It's uh, it's sweet and yum yum and make berry jammy feel strong. Berry jammy feel on top of world. I to discuss berry jammy's condition with Navara or give her some of Olga's medicine. Um, oh, berry jammy can buy medicine from Olga's chemist now. It all thanks to my friend Norara. She's brilliant. Ah! But do not tell Norara about this. Not good if she know. Hmm. Very jammy, get in trouble. Not a problem, consider it done. Just what I'd expect from the legendary hero, dumb man. Such flattery. I think I'll be needing some of that recovery ether of yours. Um. <laughs> you need to talk to Norara. Well, you don't need to, but that's a choice that I decided to make. You need to turn it back into fucking day. Very Jemmy take too much of her medicine all at once. No, not good. She's supposed to take it once a day and no more. She will get bad reaction from it. Narara need caterpillar vinegar from Tatar Marsh. Narara tell friends reason later. First, go bring Narara item. Fuck. Oh. Oh. We might not be able to. We might have to farm. Damn it. We might have to. Fucking him. Wait a second though. Give me a sec. Satata or Zazadan in Sat. Fuck. Zazadan left Satur Marsh. When we caught him in the act of being a drug dealer. <laughs> Fuck. Well. So. Where do we find this? Where do we go now? We need to go over to the fortress place. It is. Um, you see, like the Igna territory thing? Like the text? It's to the right of that text box. That's oh. where you need to be. So, this one then. Mm -hmm. Then go to the south. south. Go down into the south. You can also trade it with Satata if you have 5 stars of affinity with Connoisseurs. Which would be insane. So it's to your right, all the way back there. Like where those things are. There should be the, there should be the caterpillars. I think it's one over to your right. Yep, it's those caterpillars. Or caterpillars. No mercy. I will give it my all. No I will give it my all. Silver chest. Catapult in the car. Fuck. Three of them. Okay, let's go back over to column six. Kennedy six! There you go. Had to throw that out there. Alright, go back over to. B b b b b b no, over to Norara. The one on the balcony. Yeah. I'm getting hungry. I kind of noticed. For me, it's still too early, but oh well. After this episode, we'll go and eat then. Okay. Well, the thing is, we still have to prepare food, so by the time the food is actually done, maybe it's like time ish for you. I have no idea, and I don't care. I can deal with hunger. Well, did friends get juice? Perfect. The Rara mix up medicine now, so friends wait here. I'm trained in the art of starvation. Yeah. Which is not a good thing. Take new, take new medicine to bury Jemmy for the Rara. The Rara make make medicine weaker so it now have uh, so it not have bad effect on her. And now it's very, very bitter, so she not drink too much. Thank you, friends. Bitter projects or whatever. Go over to bury Jemmy, give it to her. <gasps> Friends bring me medicine? Yay, Berry Jemmy, drink it up. <laughs> oh boy. It too weak. But maybe it better tasting like this. Last time was too powerful. 
Don't worry about it, it was nothing. That's right, you'd have done the same for us. Really? Norara made it for Berry Jemmy? Norara, no, I uh, knew Berry Jemmy need medicine without even telling her. She's so nice to Berry Jemmy, thank you, friends. Dang, diddly done. Alright. Mm. Where is. Okay, we have to go back to the reconstruction HQ. During the day. Yeah, I'm gonna be lazy. Because... I don't care, I always do this, so. Turn it today. Uh, and then go and look for Poka Poka. We also need Ricky and Avori. Wow, well, that was perfect. Alright. Poka Poka. What the hell is this super adventure island? You can see him on the map, I think. It's this guy! Remember. Oh. How are you doing? Friends come at the right time. Poka Poka hears you know Hoko and Talon is very well. Poka Poka has a mission for you, my culinary connoisseurs. Poka Poka wants more delicate delights to tickle my tongue. Today's target is a tough catch. You must get Pagul gold pies from Sparrow's Pagals. Poka Poka would go and get them by uh, go get uh, go get by himself, but Pagals like my meat too. That is why friends must go instead of Poka Poka. Poka Poka know that Ricky look like pie, so Ricky get eaten by Pagol. <laughs> that is my fuzzy friend, always useful. You can act as bait for trap. <laughs> Trust Poka Poka, it will work. <laughs> but, 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 okay then, Ricky think Ryan better bait though. <laughs> Alright. We might have these things. Thank you, chow loving chumps. Sparrow's pag uh, Puggles uh, know some moves, so friends should look out. Not a problem, consider it done. Now it's time for Hero Pot and Hero Hump Combo! Thank you, Ricky. You are truly an inspiration. <laughs> Love it. Let's see. Yay! It's time to farm. Um, go over to, you know that, like, like the waterfall where we are slip sliding away? In Valak Mountain? You know those crab things? That also can slip around like crazy? Oh, yeah, yeah. That place. You need to fight those crabs. Mm. Nigel Waterfall. Go over to the Mechonus Wound. Oh, okay. And I you... Know. I think you know that direction, right? Yeah... I might need a little help. <laughs> you might need a little bit of a push. Go up there. Yeah. Ice Scavenge? <laughs> Uh, Imagine. Turn, turn it to night. If you if you want to get the ice cabbage, we, it needs to be night. So it would be quite handy if imagine if that was gonna be the freaking thing. It's a blizzard, by the way. Yeah, I know this. Beware level hundred enemies. Actually, no, you wouldn't. You won't run into them. <laughs> I know. Okay. I've memorized. I've memorized their oh, things. That way. Yeah. Okay. I've memorized their spawn points. <laughs> So that you don't accidentally run into them, because that would suck. But it would be cool, like just showing up like, hey, look at how powerful this thing is. <laughs> hey look, look at how much it can kill me. Cool. You are an ice cabbage. No. Okay. A rabbit stone. Not sure what you see as an I don't really know what you qualify as a cabbage. But... Meh. Amethyst vanilla. Alright. Get the items first and then start finding. A wet rat. An emerald snow. And... A wet rat. <laughs> Fuck! Alright, no let's fucking do this. Ricky can win by himself. Yeah, like, it's like. They're gonna get a silver chest, I think. Because one guy didn't drop a chest, which is good. Oh, your PC makes a butler noise. But we cannot be reckless. Yes. What? Are, ooh. What are your thoughts? A 
Money Hall. Could be that this thing is overheating. Which means? Which means I have to change thermal paste. Oh, that sucks. Yeah. Um, what are we gonna do? Are you gonna... Hmm. Well, for now it should be okay, I guess. Hmm. Well, we can continue, really. I just don't want to lose a 40 minute video, or longer. Yeah, I know. <sighs> Especially, yeah, I just don't want to lose it in general because it sucks. Uh, yep, yeah, it needs to be day. There you go. All right, this this is it. Fans have done well. Poka Poka will go to Talonet right away and get him to cook it. Go! Poka Poka cannot wait. Tasty takeout in my tum tum. Give me now while it's yum yum. Gimme, gimme, gimme! Ah, delightfully delicious. It tastes succulent, savory, sweet, and scrumptious. And a bit weird. Poka Poka want more. Don't worry about it, it was nothing. <laughs> it was nothing, you say. Only a man of your skill could truly say that. Are you sure, Melia? I am not a good judge of myself, but I'll gladly take your word for it. That was pretty nice. Poka Poka has a reward, but not food this time. Poka Poka does not want to share the, the special taste with you. <laughs> we get a gem instead. Okay, we need Ryan to be in the lead. Now it's Ryan time. It is always Ryan time. Go over to the... Uh, skill trees for a second. Um. Especially Melia's skill tree. Because I'm not sure about something. Yep. Alright, let's see which one is gonna be next. Mm. Improves critical hit rates, uh, physical defense, defense, or ease of defense. defense. Wait, what is this one? Crit rate. Ah, ease of defense. Take a look at all the rest for a second. Okay. 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 Alright, good. Okay, go to Makrish. Makrish, um... You know okay. which one she is. Makrish. Okay. It's a uh, high-end, yeah. Remember the one with lost oh, her child oh. before? Or like, not child, but the Nobunchi this one. Isn't she walking around over here? Yes. Hi there. Do you know what talent is? Everyone is quick to praise his talent and flair for food. But I just don't see it. I suppose everyone is different, but don't hate me for my taste. I'll talk to her again. Hi, Your own network. Cool. It's you! Now listen up! You're to blame for making Hoko's food taste disgusting! Oh? I'm all ears. Ryan become all ears? What that means? Forgive me, I lost composure for a second. But you must see his popularity is affecting the quality of his food. How can people even attempt to enjoy something so normal? Listen up, lady. Food is food. <laughs> Eat up or shut up. That's what I say. <laughs> oh. Uh, like. You don't understand. I won't be satisfied by anything other than Hoko's stoppy touch. Can you not see that man? All here? All right already. Calm down before someone takes you away from uh, for disturbing the peace. <laughs> I'm sorry. I've only that. I've only myself to blame. I get so impatient and short-tempered when I'm hungry. <laughs> Is it my fault that I can only eat Hoko's monstrous meals? The strange and wonderful smells emanating from his restaurants. They are simply intoxicating. You're a weirdo, all right, no doubt about it. How long has it been since you last ate his stuff? I haven't eaten his food since it changed its taste, so... About 20 days in total. <laughs> that long, huh? You must be starving for his old stuff then. Can nothing be done? Tell me, I need Hoko's old taste back. Then I can be myself again. 
You will not be sorry, sir. I know this. Uh, I know this isn't a typical request, but the pain. Could you never understand? You could never understand this longing. Hurry, please. No, sir. We'll be done before you know it. Yes, let's enter all this man as quickly as possible. Go to Hoko. Wait, that's the knob on, right? Yep. Hoko, I have a favor to ask. You know that you know that high anti girl was always coming by here? Do you think you could cook her with one of your old bad tasting meals? Hoko know who friends mean. But recently bird girl not come to eat anymore. And Hoko busy right now. Business really good. Why Hoko have to make special food for just one bird girl? Just make it for her already, or someone's gonna die, man! <laughs> but but why friend gets so angry? No need to be so impatient. Sorry about that, Hoko. Got carried away. But I'm not messing around here. Yours is the only grub this girl is willing to eat, so work with me. That not sound good. Okay, Hoko made food, make food for girl. But Hoko have problem. Hoko need all the ingredients. Hoko stop using them, remember? Can friends bring soya paste shells? Friends get from Ed Edma King's or Barbaric Citri on Valak Mountain. Hmm. Then I make food bird, bird girl likes. Leave it to us, Hoko. Do okay. we have the stuff? Of nope, no, 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 no. And McKings, I remember having to farm these guys for some kind of reason, and lo and behold, here is that reason once again. Uh, wait, Phallic wait. Mountain, the McConnell's wound. Big spider dudes. Big spider dudes, okay. That's down. Right? Hmm? Down? Well, down the mountain, technically, yeah. yeah. Those spider guys? Big spider guys. That's further down the mountain. You have definitely seen them before. Yeah. We should have one of them because we beat uh, Barbaric City, which is one of the enemies we need to beat for that one quest. Hmm. Also, you have a unique monster of that kind, so that's why. Look to your right for a sec. Up the mountain to your right. Because you ran past a lot of enemies. There you go. This will be a breeze. Ricky want to bam smack this time. I will give it my all. No okay. These guys are like a little bit of mini bosses. They take a butt of uh, like a buttload of yeah. He's gonna get toppled. Use uh, well, no, I'm using the other one. Yeah, sure. Then you have the lariat next to him. Oh, no. oh, yeah, lariat is a pretty powerful move. Never. Burn it up. Saw your pace child. And there you go. Wow. Wait, was that it? Or? Yes, that was it, yeah. Like oh. I said, we got one of them from the unique monster, and this one dropped the silver chest, which gave us another one. Nice. So, no far not, not a lot of farming. That's good. Alright, next up, go back over to Hoko, of course. It was crazy, we're on page 78 of the 142. Hmm. <laughs> we pretty far in. You find ingredient, wowie! Hold on while Hoko make food. Ta da! Hoko very happy to make food for all days. Hoko even feel like making smelly food is more fun. Whatever you say, you're the boss. Lately, Hoko made food, make food that, the that all customers like. That's how Hoko stay in business. But then Hoko not make food that Hoko want to make. Which way is right way? Which way is wrong way? Wow. Beats me? Haven't got a clue. But friend look, in look impatient, so I say friend just pick answer now. Hoko can't decide for himself. You can choose. It will not make that much of a difference. So, make food your customers want, or make food you want to make? Well, it's a bit of a dilemma, because of course you want to just do whatever the hell you want to do. But if no one wants the stuff that you do, then you have a business, basically. Yep. So... Hmm. 
But you say it doesn't really influence nope, anything? Nope, it doesn't influence anything. Then do whatever the hell you want to do, mate. Friend right, Hoko should believe in his own style of cooking. It's not matter if only one cu uh, customer think Hoko's was be stage yum. Go ask Burke, a bird girl to come... Uh, Burke? <laughs> bird girl to come eat before food get cold. Go back to McRish. Has Hoko gone back to his roots? Does his food taste, uh, taste as it used to be? Then I shall use all my remaining strength to sample it once more. <laughs> yep, it's done. Go enjoy yourself, lady. It's delicious once again. You persuaded Hoko to, co uh, to cook to my tastes. He's wonderful, isn't he? Well, that's that. Finished. Well done, Ricky. Of course, I haven't forgotten about you as well. Thank you for everything. I have a gift for you. It's something I'm sure you'll love. Hoko's leftovers from last night. <laughs> Thanks. Keep it, you nutter! You seem to be somewhat lacking in patience today. I know just a remedy. Today? I've been in a bad mood since I've met you, lady. <laughs> I hope you're happy now. Now <laughs> you've got your knob on slop or something. I appreciate how much attention you gave me. You are a kind man. Come on, lady. You're making me blush. <laughs> you fell for my joke. You are a funny one. That was a joke? Give me a break! <laughs> May I pass meet again in more pleasant circumstances? <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> I love that. I love that so much. I'd ship it. Oh. Alright, there you go. Gerblamo. Impatient skill has been unlocked. <laughs> nice. So now we have another skill tree. Branch for uh, Ryan. Okay, have melee in the party, which you already do. Mm -hmm. Go to the Armu farm. The place where Noppa was like a tiny Noppa. Uh, is it back here? You can go this way and then to the left after this building. You can go back there. Oh, yeah, there yeah. the farm. Yes. 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 You need to turn back time to 10 o'clock. Uh, wait, then? Mm-hmm. Okay. There he is. I feel like a moth flying head first into an ether lamp over and over. Please, 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 I need your help. What is it? You're looking down in the dumps. Ricky smell big problem. Ryan, ask what's wrong. Ask, ask, ask! Okay, okay, don't cough up a hairball. I'll ask right away, just give me a sec. Now, uh, now don't, well, uh, don't tell me if you forgot the great favor you did me. After you found me, I went back to say hello to her. And before I know it, I am back to square one and under her wings. Uh, she feed me awful food. My life, <laughs> from Hong Kong, my life being, uh, my life being a living nightmare. She strokes and pats me non-stop and makes me sleep on her bed. The worst, uh, the worst be when I has to, when I has to, uh, has to carry shopping like a pack armor. She treat me just like servant. I can't bear it anymore. Help me win my freedom back. I, uh, he's here. I ignore him. Okay. I appreciate it. Uh, well, I appreciate that I'm. Well, I appreciate that I'm still young and not worldly wise. But is this how Nopon are treated back in the Imperial capital? Spot on, lady. It be terrible. To me, it just seems as if she is a little. She uh, she's being a little overprotective. Maybe some, uh, maybe some middle-aged Nopon like to be treated as pets. Oh boy. <laughs> but I not be one of them. I feel as if be, uh, as if she be mocking me. So please help a guy in need. All right. Hmm. Okay, my plan is simple. I need smelly perfume. If I uh. smell so unbearably bad, she will not let me let, let me in the house. <laughs> hmm. Deja but you, vu? but you must keep this secret. Do not tell my Christian. No, so it'll be done before you know it. Eat up and show you what you can do. Okay, now we're gonna go and... We're actually gonna go and talk to McQuish. Instead of doing this. Okay. We're gonna screw this Nopal's career.
I don't know why I chose this. There has to be a reason why, but I don't remember. Alright, McQuish. Freaking weird high Antia girl. She should be around here. Right? Huh. Hmm. Maybe turn time a little bit forward or something. Wait, so where the hell is she now? Mm -hmm. What the fuck? Oh, she might be at Hoko's place now. Um, that is? That guy, like the left one? Um, yeah, fuck. there she is. Have you percent per chance seen Doctor Rick? I can see from your face you have uh, you have. Tell me, please, what is he doing? So that's what Doctor Rick is planning. Then I have a plan for him. Do you think you can get me some pure uh, some pure pure perfume? Its scent is magnificent and the and complete opposite of this one. If you give that to Doctor Rick, his plan will be foiled. All right. Go to Magna Forest. <sighs> God damn it. Ugh. Sneeze? Yeah, but it doesn't wanna, you know. Go I all know, away. yeah, I know. Go all out. Okay, what? Mark, take On an island north of the Great Magna Falls. See that little island in the middle of the big lake? Yes. That's not the island that I'm talking about, but... This one? That's not the island that I'm talking about, but... Huh? Oh, this one. That's the big uh -huh. lake, yeah? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, this one? Yes. Yes. Go over there. Um... Over here? Oh. Just go over to the Divine Sanctuary. Divine Sanctuary. After this quest, we're gonna end up the episode and we're gonna eat. Thank you. Sure, Oliver! You wanna watch out though, because I think that there might be a really nasty enemy right now. Actually, no, that's. no. no. That's fine. It's the huge creative thing in the middle, right? Yep. Yeah, that's the exclamation mark. We're getting there. TV! Yeah, I know. TV! I know. You I got have... 55 seconds left. Yeah. You got 50 seconds left. You got... Oh. Don't mind. Nah. I wanted, nah. To, I wanted to stop it in time. Oh, man. Oh. Phew, this game is hard, man. It's a little bit difficult to let's play actually. Quite surprised. Well, I don't know, my mind legs are just being annoying. Which they usually aren't actually. Oh well. I don't give a single fucking shit. At least it's not my back this time. Usually it's my back. Yeah. Alright. Get the lovely item. I'll bring it over to Dr. Rick! Points. 
Mm -hmm. you're doing quests. I see how I need it. Huh? Wait, wait, wait a minute. It smells good. Hmm. If you be sure it will work, then I will use it. I shall go, I shall go spam, spam for myself up and put a plan, my plan into action. I will soon be free. <laughs> Make sure you go to see my Chris later on. She will need a shoulder to cry on when she rejects me. Farewell and wish me luck. Okay, go with the brush. Naparik smells like nature intended. Thank you for handing him the wrong perfume. Now I can cuddle and snuggle with him forever and ever. I don't know what, uh, what bothers with living with different people. I believe that it's beautiful being harmonious with everyone. Well, does that. Ruined that novel's life. I'm ever so happy. This is the best day ever. <laughs> and I have few people to thank for my happiness. There you go. Show leggings. Okay, save, wait, end of the episode and then we're gonna save the game. Yeah.